when he turned his back from shoulder to shoulder it looked like as wide as the tailgate of a truck and this darkness literal darkness just came like all over just just all over me except where i was standing this thing let out the most blood curdling mind blowing spine tingling scream that you've ever heard in your life and it cut through me like a knife and I knew that they were going to take me. I just knew it. And then the next thing I can remember is being levitated. Well, when I look in there, uh, I see two big eyes staring back at me. Hello and welcome. You're listening to The Bump Podcast, a place for the believers of the unexplained, monsters, and paranormal. Join us, and we'll go face-to-face -face with what goes bump in the night. I woke up and I, I could smell that my mother was cooking breakfast and I was just laying in the bed with my back to the wall waiting on her to call me for breakfast and uh, I just I felt this hand on my shoulder and, and you know the fingers they, they felt very long thin and it wasn't grabbing me it was just touching me just laid his hand on my shoulder and this voice said, you don't get to go. I want to try something. Walk slow and stop. Well, we walked slow, stopped, and we got, you know, walked a little faster and stopped. And whatever's behind us, it, it, you know, mocked us the same. I mean, it done everything the same. And uh, you was asking about smell earlier. It had a, a pungent smell. That's how close it must have been to us. Yep. And we kept on walking, and uh, I mean, it's a smell you'll never forget. What and, did it uh, smell like? Can, can, can maybe, you... that, that that's hard because I mean, it caught I caught a whiff of it. It not really like a wet dog, but almost like a wet dog type deal. It stunk yeah. it. I mean, it's it's wild. Yeah, we was probably like we was probably like ten yards from the truck, and um, I said, "All right, let's go a little faster, get onto the truck." And uh, we and by then, doing those like little tests I was doing, you know, walking fast, slowing down, walking fast. It was following us, and you know, I started getting excited. I, I kind of knew what it was. <laughs> yeah, and and the person I was with didn't have a clue so i didn't want to say nothing to them and like i said when I, when I parked my truck on top of that mountain it's a like i said a little atv trail out which i didn't know so there's like i had to like park it like on the side of the mountain almost like a little parking area parking area mm -hmm. that thing come up behind us walked two-legged i mean i swear on the side of the mountain walked two-legged got up in front of my truck 